بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ویلکم ٹو آور سیکنڈ سیشن ڈسکسنگ اباؤٹ فیو امپورٹنٹ فنکشنس آف ایکسل وچ آف کورس آر ریلیٹڈ ٹو این ای آر پی کنسلٹنٹ ڈے ٹو ڈے جاب اینڈ فائنانس ایز ویل اینڈ مینی ادر فیلڈ ایز ویل بٹ سنس آئی ایم ڈسکسنگ کنسلٹنٹس ای آر پی کنسلٹنٹس سو جسٹ ٹرائنگ ٹو فوکس دیئر ریکوائرمنٹس Okay, let's say for example, today we are going to discuss VLOOKUP, a challenge we face normally in VLOOKUP. VLOOKUP, uh, as a standard, we discussed in the last video, which uh, is based on a primary key, where there is a column which is unique, and you can search based on that. But in data, when you are dealing day-to-day -day things, like I'm giving you an example of customer master, where you have built to site as well, so you have to... Uh, customer will not be a unique in like sales data or any other data uh, so you have to <coughs> excuse me uh, another column as well that is called composite uh, so we will make composite key now in our today's session mean meaning our one column is not unique so we have to join another column we can increase as well but uh, today I am just I will join two so you can increase to three or four as per your requirements So, <clears throat> we'll discuss another advanced form of VLOOKUP where we'll uh, make some changes in our data in order to achieve the result. Let me show you the data and the challenge. For example, here we have country's uh, population year-wise. So, let's say it is 2000, uh, then if we go down, next year will come, but country will be duplicated. And same down for next year 2010 so if you see here country is getting duplicated with the year right uh, <clears throat> then we have the population in thousands of course if you see here this is our requirement now this is the challenge i'm uh, taking it as an example here we have countries all these countries uh, listed here again same Uh, till end, uh, I think the last one is Zimbabwe, I believe. Uh, yeah, Zimbabwe, see here. So up to this, but we will not uh, replicate again and again the, uh, the country because country will be once. Here we have on the top year. So 2000, 2005, 10 and 15, right? Now we need a VLOOKUP here. So it will go f country plus year because only country will not work we need another join that is a composite key of year as well now in order to achieve this we need a composite key here and while doing VLOOKUP we need country plus year as a parameter to be passed to the uh, VLOOKUP function let's try what I will do at the start of this uh, data I will create a key just I will I'm naming a key where I will put equal to country and concatenate. Concatenate is ampersand sign. When you uh, join two um, cells or two columns, two, two columns data. So here it is, right? Now if you see here in our composite key, this is our composite key, where it is country plus year. And what I will do, I will put uh, select column, control C, and paste special values. So now it is value, not a formula. I'm coming here, and I will put now here VLOOKUP function. Now lookup value, lookup value it will be our country. Again here ampersand sign and the year right now since we are making this formula in a way that when we will copy in other sense we will write only once it's not something in for every year we will write we will write once so we will copy here in other cells so whole table will be populated at once so in this case uh, if you see uh, this country we we will keep column constant that should be f but row we will not make it constant so here i will put a dollar sign in other side year wise i will keep this row constant so when we will copy on the right side 
uh, row should not change it will keep the row this one where we have the uh, uh, row 3 uh, where we have the years right now going to the table now this is done table I will select now key should be my first column right this is the prereq of VLOOKUP that where you what you have to search that should be the first column so I will select up to population so my population is fourth column one two three four right so now I will move down till end all years I have to select okay and press F4 this is important to make it constant otherwise when we we'll copy the range will move down here I as I told you our uh, population is fourth column so I will select fourth column right since here we will put it zero false or we can make it because our data is sorted so we can even put it true but it will keep with zero and if you see here Afghanistan population for uh, year 2000 is this much exactly same right now <clears throat> what we'll do we'll move it on the right side so all Afghanistan population got populated right uh, and then if we select all these uh, all these cells and double click if we move down all our table got populated so let me check one for example <clears throat> this is America Samoa uh, which is for 2015 right so I will select here this is 55 right 55,000 so I will select here control F control V here it is 58 it's correct next is 57 next Oh, sorry below I had some function used so I will click here and move this one right so now I will search okay here 57 correct and 56 uh, 2010 and here it is uh, 55 exactly matching so in this way we achieved our result and we prepared this table uh, which is year wise by using composite key and concatenate concatenation you can also use a uh, function um, to concatenate that is called concatenate I used ampersand sign uh, both have the same functionality uh, hope you will like it if still you have any question kindly post under this uh, video so that will reply thank you very much